Hi, this is Rahat from Gizmodon. I'm making this video to talk about the best SMS application or an organizer that you can download for your Android device. This is an application called SMS Organizer from Microsoft. And the reason we want to talk about this today is because we get a lot of SMSs every day and usually most of the applications can just put them in two buckets, which is your normal messages and your spam messages. And even then, they're not really good at bifurcating or segregating those SMSs into these two buckets, which is why I've been using SMS Organizer for almost over two years now. And what this application basically does is puts them into multiple different buckets. So you have mostly your personal messages, your transaction messages, and let's say in transaction messages, you will see your OTPs, your bank transactions that you've made, your bills that you have received, for example, from Adani Electricity, all of these bills will go into transaction. You then have personal messages where you receive from personal contacts or specific messages that you've sent come into these personal bucket. And it usually is very helpful and does put them into the right bucket. You also have something called promotional messages then, which is basically putting them based on promotions that you receive. So let's say you're receiving messages from Mintra or any of the other shopping websites that you usually shop with. So all of your messages that are promotional will fall into this. You then have start messages, which is, let's say, if you want to start any message or favorite any message, it will go over there. But usually this is how they segregate all of your messages into these buckets. Now, that's not all. You also have reminder finance and offers that you can see on top. Now, all of these reminders are, let's say, if you have to pay a bill, it'll tell you that, OK, this is an X amount of bill that you're supposed to pay for Adani Electricity. And it'll also give you a notification. Now, you have to keep that in mind that this is only accessing your SMSs. So you, it's basically giving you all of these notifications from your SMS. So if there's no SMS, it will not be able to give you a reminder. The other is finance. Now, finance is where um, all of your transactions that you've made would come over here. Now, usually what you see over here is I made a transaction on Paytm for 400 and odd bucks. And it's showing me that there was a debit that happened from Paytm. So this is like a passbook of all your debit cards, your credit cards and your wallets. It is extremely user friendly to use and you can actually see, you know, what your balance is and so on and so forth. So it's actually pretty intuitive to use as well. The last piece is offers. Now, these are offers, not just that you've received from your SMS or from Mintra and so on. These are also ones that are available on web and so on. So let's say if you're planning to shop from Mintra, you want to see if there's any specific offer that's available for Mintra. You can actually look over here. So for example, there's one that's available for Visa cards, 1,800 and above if you purchase something from Mintra, you can actually use that particular promo code and actually apply that as well. Now this is apart from what you've already received in your motions with your messages. So like I said, I've been using this for almost two years now and I've been absolutely loving it. I don't receive unnecessary notifications from SMSs for the bunch of SMS that I received from promotions and other shopping websites. And it also keeps it very clutter free, right? This is the best application that you can download for your Android device to manage and organize all your SMSs. I hope you liked this video. Give a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you loved the video as well. And let me know if there's any other video that you would want me to make. I would be glad to do that. Thank you so much.